Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Fallout 2. Uh, we have a quest to find Chip's spleen. He apparently lost it in a uh, card game. And uh, I believe he said it was with the, uh, the general store guy. So let's go see if we can talk to him, get that spleen back. I mean, that's, that's pretty, uh, pretty ridiculous that someone would just take his spleen like that. How'd they get it out of him, anyway? They always know where I'm going. Jeez. Guess you're not a spy. Oh, they like me. They really like me. Uh, who are you? I'm Laucho. I run this establishment, Flying Dragon 8, a general store. I have been known to trade in information. What kind of information? Well, a little happens in this town that I do not know about. Uh, of course, you must know the right question to ask, yes? What do you need to know? I'm looking for a spleen. A spleen? <laughs> yes, Chip from the Valdez. The, 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 the tanker there is known as the Valdez, yes. Interestingly enough, it's actually named after a developer as opposed to the Exxon Valdez. Although that's probably a nice coincidence. Chip from the Valdez lost his spleen in a card game the other day. I sold it to Dr. Wong. He was fascinated by it. How do you lose a spleen? He was drunk. Very, very drunk. He was obsessed with his spleen all night long. And then he bet it. So you took his spleen? Yes, it was a debt. He is an honorable man. You're a sick, rude bastard, aren't you? You are a dishonorable person. I will not have you in my shop. Come back some other time. Whatever. Hmm. Looking for some information. Well, hopefully I can find that guy. Do you have anything else that I can buy right now other than guns and bullets? Not really. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna actually load, because, uh, I, I kinda would rather not piss the guy off. Still, taking the guy's spleen is pretty terrible. Uh, so this is, once you've talked to Chip, um, you have a timer. I don't think it's when you get to that screen. I think it's when you talk to him. Kind of rude if it was once you get to that screen. But, uh... I'm not sure what it is. It's either 24 or 48 hours, I think. Something like that. And then he'll die. Uh, who are you? I'm looking for some information. Looking for a spleen. Dr. Wong? Where can I find him? Dr. Wong is a head scientist in the Steel Palace. Seek him there. How do you lose a spleen, incidentally? Huh. Well... What?! It still goes into that. Alright, well, I guess I should have pissed him off. He is a terrible person. It is definitely not an honorable thing to take someone's bet spleen. If someone is betting their spleen, you should be going... Alright, you had enough to drink now. Time for you to stop. And guys, you're in my way. Yep. Uh, who are you? I'm Dr. Wong. I'm the head scientist of this installation. Uh, more questions, please. I hear you have someone else's spleen. Ah, yes, indeed. I will prepare it with fava beans and a nice Chianti. You do know that you're supposed to serve liver with that wine instead of spleen, right? Haha! <laughs> yes, I too saw that movie, that old movie. Wait, what are you saying? Are you saying that? Yes, it's a human spleen. It's a human spleen? Lao Cho didn't tell me that. Tell your friend to come by for it within the next day and I will gladly return it to him. I just hope you can find a way to replace it in his body in time. Uh, I gained 2,000 experience points. Very well. 
All right, let's go talk to Chip. Let him know that, uh... We got a spleen back. Of course, doesn't help him outside of his body. So Marcus said uh, there was a little pop-up saying, you know, you humans never cease to amaze me. Um, I mean, Marcus probably doesn't remember what he was like beforehand, I suppose. I'd have to go back and look at his dialogue and, and see. Um, but uh, I've never quite understood this thing where you, you, get the, you get people who were once human, clearly once human, not even, like, in their lifetime, in they were human. A and they're like, Oh, you humans never cease to amaze me, kind of. I don't, I don't get that at all. I, I just cannot fathom stopping to think of yourself as a human in that kind of context. And thinking of everyone else, you know, as different. Oh, whatever. Uh, have you found my spleen yet? Yes, Dr. Wong Yi Zi has it, and he'll give it back to you. Go talk to him about it. All right. Uh, before I do, maybe we ought to set up a way to get it back in me. Talk to Dr. Fung about that, all right? Thanks. All right. I really appreciate what you're doing for me. I won't forget it. No problem. I'm getting experience for it. Well, this door seems to be open. What do you got on here? Absolutely nothing. Still nothing. Alright, well, we'll, uh... Look around some more later. Well, there's some stuff in here. What do we got? Nothing. I hear the Shu Emperor is inhumanly smart. Oh, yeah, that's uh, more more accurate than you might think. All right, I don't actually know where Doctor Fung is. I don't think he's in this steel palace. So originally, you were supposed to be able to go to the submarine, which would have been pretty cool. I think the maps are still in the game, although I don't know if there's a way to access them. Uh, quote-unquote, legally. You know, like, I was able to get into the, um... one section of town in one of the other towns uh, that was cut. And... I was able to get into that... Can we get into this building? Well, it would help if Sulik weren't in my way. We can, but I'm pretty sure... Oh, and I do need to check on something uh, about uh, Matt not being there. Did I never come in and talk to you? I don't think I ever came in and talked to you. Help you with something? Um, yeah, do you have any stim packs? I'd like to buy some. But first, uh, I have a... Uh, who are you? Who am I? I am Dr. Fung. I teach and I heal. Dr. Fung, do you know Doc Holliday? Holliday? Yes, I taught him all he knows. Where is he now? He's living in Broken Hills. Uh, I went home he did. I hope he has found peace there. I think he has. I have more questions. Um, I have a friend who's missing a spleen. Can you help him? Of course I can, and since you are aware of Doc Holliday, I will do it for no more than the sake of friendship. Tell your spleenless friend to come here and I will replace it for him. Uh, thanks, I have more questions, though. Uh, what can you tell me about armor implants? I helped write the article on armor implants. All it takes is my expertise and your materials. What sort of implants do you desire? Uh, what sort are there? Uh, we have dermal implants, which protect against concussive damage, if you like... 
If you like that work, we can aid a sing add a single enhancement to it. We also have Phoenix implants, which also have an upgrade available. If you're interested in the upgrades, you will of course have to wait until the initial set has been installed. And before you ask, yes, you can have all four operations. Um, I have other questions. I don't think I'm going to get any of those. I don't need them with power armor, I think. I don't know that, that they're cumulative. Uh, do you have any stim packs? I'd like to buy some. And he does. Sure, we'll do that. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and quick save. And check on his, uh, his stuff. Nothing there. Nothing there. Probably nothing back here. Probably nothing in here either, but we might as well check, right? All right, let's go uh, see a chip. Let him know that, uh, his spleen can be reinserted. So that would have cost me a thousand, um, dollars if I had not talked to Doc Holliday and, uh, informed him of it. So I saved some of my uh, uh, much-needed caps. To be honest, I, I don't know why there are caps in the game. <laughs> like, you, you can buy everything with just stuff. Did you talk to Fung? Yes, and he says I'll stick it in you for free. Wow, you have some serious connections. Come back in a day and I'll see what help I can give you. You got a friend. Information and I'm in pain? You want information? Uh, no, forget it. So he should be back in a day. Let's go ahead and see what else we can do around here. Hello? He belches loudly. What do you want? Let's belch right back. He summons another throaty burp. Belch louder. He spits forth a horrific belch that defies the very heavens in its volume and depth. A punk wearing a half smile. Um... Who are you? I'm Badger. I used to have a band. I called ourselves There w There We Smolder. Now I'm the resident computer tech in San Fran. Uh, what sort of computer stuff do you do? Well, uh, let's just say I'm an information retrieval specialist. W what does that mean? It means that I can find data you need. I see. Cool. I have some more questions. Um, what can you tell me about this tanker? You want to talk to Mark or the captain about that? Where can I find Mark? Eh, you can usually find Mark down the bar. I have some more questions. Uh, do do do. Where can I find the captain? Captain's usually on the bridge. Just go up the stairs in the bar. Okay, more questions. What do you do here? I'm the resident computer genius. Okay. So we could have used him to uh, do some stuff, but uh, I don't think we can now. Uh, nothing. Nice belch. Kind of surprised this uh, computer is still working. Failed to learn anything. Activating motivators.
All right, anyone up here? Hello? I'd flirt with you, but I'm not interested. Oh. Look at all these new punks, posers. Nothing in there. There's a whole lot of nothing in the containers in the late game for some reason. I mean, except for like, you know, armory areas in Navarro and stuff. Nothing's on. A friendly looking punk. What can I do for you, Mama Jamma? Who are you? I'm Mark. I'm the resident smartass and know it all. He smiles. Oh, I have other questions. Do you barter? Nope. What is this place? This is a Poseidon Marine Vessel Valdez, also called the PMV Valdez. If you want more information about the Valdez, the best person to ask is the captain. Uh, the captain? Who's that? Captain is a tough-ass mili old military guy. He sits upstairs and upstairs there and checks the place out. He's got some thorough knowledge about the ship. Thanks. I have some more questions. Uh, who's in charge? In charge? No one's in charge of us. Well, where'd you all come from? Uh, all over the wasteland. We heard things about San Francisco passed down from our elders. Some of us have ancestors who used to live here before the Great War. You want to hear more? Uh, sure. Uh, we're a band of musicians, tech heads, geeks, and artists. We thought we'd come back to some place famous for artistic and personal freedom. I came here to spawn. Want to hear more still? Sure. Well, when we got here, we figured we'd camp out here until we either figured out how to get this tanker moving again, or until we thought of something else. Have you figured out how to move the tanker? I think the captain's figured out how to do it. But we need several elements first. We've basically given up on taking it for ourselves, to tell the truth. We've got other plans now. Well, what are they? You want to know what our plans are? Uh, we're going to keep moving around until we can find a place that hasn't been screwed over by human greed, and then we're going to try to set up a better society. Do you know how you're going to do that? Uh, we're hoping if we can avoid society's mistakes. Hell, things can't get much worse. Well, tell me about the hubologists. They're crazy. Don't trust them, unless you're mentally feeble or, or like being screwed over. They're interested only in your money and your soul, and there's a good chance they'll destroy the one to get the other. I've seen it happen too many times. Well, tell me about the she. Uh, they're a good sort as far as they go. They're a little untrusting of outsiders, but then that's not always such a bad attitude to take in these times. They've got some weird customs and they talk funny, but they're alright. I have other questions. Alright, nothing. Bye. Thank you, Mark. I'm closed. Go away. Hmm. Alright, what if I sleep until morning? How is he closed at 1800? Sarcasm. Sure are a lot of strong women around here, huh? Hmm. What about noon? Do you open at noon? Nope. Okay. Maybe we'll come back later. Maybe he doesn't open until, like, 10. I don't know. Alright, this is just a, a toilet. I did see the stairs up here, but I'm not going to go up just yet. There's a staircase down. I don't want to go down just yet. Those she sure look funny, huh? Come on, there's got to be Asians left over. Asian Americans left over. I saw Selmy and Barrow torn apart downstairs. What's going on downstairs? Next bozo calls me bitch gets fat. Flash fried. Nothing's on. 
It's a tight little room back there. Uh, Goris. Oh, maybe I can keep going back here. Okay. Do not know how to get in there. Nothing. Nothing. Missing a doorway into this room? I do not know. Alright, let's see if you have anything anything new in stock or anything like that. Well you got a shiv. Yay. Cal the gun merchant. One day is not enough for them to uh, restock, that's for sure. Okay. That's fine. Uh, someone does have my energy cells, and I'm going to need those back. What, Jimmy? It's not you. Ah, it was you. Good. All right. That's it for now. Uh, let's go up and talk to the uh, the captain, I guess. Or the captain. I guess I'll enunciate. HS9 cheated us and he'll cheat you if you let him. I'll share my girlfriend if you show if you'll share yours. Ew. Yuck. That is disgusting. You see someone wearing a captain's hat. What the hell do you want? I don't speak to anyone unless they're friends or, or good people. Do something for one of my buddies and then come talk to me. Okay. Hmm. Does, does doing something for Chip count? I suppose we're not done with, uh... Doing something for Chip. Let me just double check. Is, uh... Yeah, science is seven. Welcome to PosidoNet. This terminal is limited to transmission between one tanker, PMV Valdez, and docking rig. Command? Uh, check status. Fuel tanks, empty. Cargo hold, empty. Navigation computer, non-functional. Mooring lines, attached. Okay, log off. So there's a lot going on there that, uh, we need. Obviously we need some fuel. These stairs down? Yeah. I think we saw the she stuff talk about fuel. I bet my bo boyfriend offered to share me. Oh, hmm. Hmm. Oh, 
Awkward. Let's go ahead and quick save. Down we go. Oh, hi, stuff. Wanamingos. You know, I probably should have uh, waited a moment. Um, because it is about time to uh, end the episode. Oh, and we got uh, centaurs. Well, that's just fantastic. That is a vault tech door right there. Hmm. Let me go back upstairs. I think when we come back next time, we'll head down there and uh, see what trouble we can get into. See you next time, everyone.